Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is What, Where, How and When? Question number 1. Who out of these explores and excavates tools, weapons, coins etc. to study about the past? Option A. Scientists. Option B. Archaeologists. Option C. Historians. Option D. Engineers. The correct answer is Option B. Archaeologists. Archaeology is the study of cultures that lived in the past. It is a subfield of anthropology, the study of human cultures. Archaeologists look for patterns in the artifacts they study that give them clues about how the people who made and used them lived. Question number 2. Name the large kingdom situated on the banks of the Ganga. Option. Patliputra. Option B. Maratha. Option C. Magdha. Option D. Indus. The correct answer is Option C. Magdha. Magdha was an ancient kingdom located on the Indo Gangetic Plains in eastern India and spread over what is today the modern state of Bihar. Question number 3. The letter BCE stands for Option A. Before Common Era. Option B. Before Christ Era. Option C. Behind Common Evolution. Option D. Before Christ Evolution. The correct answer is Option A. Before Common Era, BCE, Before Common Era, and BC, Before Christ, mean the same thing previous to year 1 CE, Common Era. This is the same as the year AD 1, Anno Domini, the latter means in the year of the Lord, often translated as in the year of our Lord. Question number 4. Where Garo Hills are located? Option A. Southwest. Option B. Northeast. Option C. Northwest. Option D. Southeast. The correct answer is Option B. Northeast. Garo Hills are situated in the northeast of India. This is one of the areas where agriculture developed in earlier times. Question number 5. The places where rice was first grown. Option A. Garo Hills. Option B. Kirthar. Option C. Suleiman. Option D. Vindayas Hills. The correct answer is. Option D. Vindayas Hills. There were some areas where agriculture developed. The places where rice was first grown are to the north of the Vindayas. Question number 6. Which of the following is not the tributaries of Ganga? Option A. Koshi. Option B. Ghaghar. Option C. Ravi. Option D. Gomti. The correct answer is. Option C. Ravi. The major left bank tributaries of the Ganga are Ram Ganga, Gomti, Ghaghara, Kosi, and Mahananda. The right bank tributaries of the Ganga are Yamuna, Tamsa, Sun, and Punpun. Question number 7. In ancient times the area along Ganga and its tributaries rivers to the south of the Ganga was known as Option A. Magdha. Option B. Patliputra. Option C. Koshambi. Option D. Nalanda. The correct answer is. Option A. Magdha. In ancient times the area along the Ganga and its tributaries to the south of the Ganga was known as Magdha. Its rulers were very powerful and set up a large kingdom there. Question number 8. Language used by common people was. Option A. Pali. Option B. Prakrit. Option C. Sanskrit. Option D. Greek.
The correct answer is option B. Prakrit. Many poems, epics and plays were written in the ancient times. Many of these were written in Sanskrit, but others were written in Prakrit i.e. languages used by ordinary people. Question number 9. The word India comes from the Indus, called underscore in Sanskrit. Option A. Indira. Option B. Indica. Option C. Sindhu. Option D. Bharat. The correct answer is Option C. Sindhu. The word India comes from the Indus, called Sindhu in Sanskrit. The word Sindhu is the native name of the Indus River. Question number 10. Greece located in Option A. Africa. Option B. Australia. Option C. Asia. Option D. Europe. The correct answer is Option D. Europe. Greece is located in Europe. The Greeks who came through the northwest of India about 2500 years ago and were familiar with the Indus, called it the Hindus or the Indos. Question number 11. Who called India Hindus or Indos? Option A. The Iranians and the Turkish. Option B. The Iranians and the Greeks. Option C. The Iranians and the Chinese. Option D. The Americans and the Greeks. The correct answer is Option B. The Iranians and the Greeks. The Iranians and the Greeks who came through the Northwest about 2500 years ago and were familiar with the Indus River, called it the Hindus or the Indos, and the land to the east of the river was called India by them. Question number 12. Manuscript means Option A. Books written by pen. Option B. Books written by hands. Option C. Books written by pencil. Option D. Books written through computers. The correct answer is Option B. Books written by hands. Manuscript means books written by hands. The word manuscript comes from the Latin word manu meaning hand. Question number 13. Manu means Option A. Hands. Option B. Eyes. Option C. Fingers. Option D. Ear. The correct answer is Option A. Hands. Manu means hands. Manu is the Latin word which means hand in English. Question number 14. Kandahar is present day. Option A. Iran. Option B. Pakistan. Option C. Afghanistan. Option D. India. The correct answer is Option C. Afghanistan. Kandhar is present day Afghanistan, which was ruled by the ruler named Ashoka. Question number 15. Jesus was founder of Option A. Christianity. Option B. Muslims. Option C. Jews. Option D. Hinduism. The correct answer is Option A. Christianity. Jesus Christ was the founder of Christianity. He was called the Son of God. The years are counted from the date generally assigned to the birth of Jesus Christ. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonder Slate app now, link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.